Hey everybody. My last video, we were visited the Spur Creek Saloon. So I got a little map. I'm going to show you how you get there in case I was confusing in the last video when I was out in Sturgis. I'm going to show you that. I want to show you a nice quiet ride we took. We got some photos to pop up that took us back to Wall. Stay tuned to the end of the video. I want to introduce you to my new friend, which I think everybody will be pleased with, Christy. I want to introduce you to Christy. So please stay tuned to the video. I want to go over this map and show you the route we took. Hey everybody, the last video I done was on a Spur Creek Saloon. So I'd like to show you how I got there in case it was a little confusing. Because sometimes when you're in Sturgis, you just don't think clear. So I drew a little map, not to scale, you will be able to tell. So, if you're in Sturgis, you just take 34 out. There's 79. The Full Throttle Saloon is here. You keep going north through Newell up to the Spur Creek Saloon. So you drive right straight through Newell. 212 will head back to the east. You will see 212 down here that goes to Belfuche. You just drive right straight through. Like I said, you go through Newell. Spur Creek Saloon's up there. Nice place. Check out the video. It's uh, a laid-back atmosphere. Just a nice place to visit. Go out there and hang out for a couple hours. They got some buffalo roaming around there. Uh, they got some stuff to do. Some saddles. You can try last soon. A set of horns. Just neat. But anyway, on Wednesday, we took a ride. We were all day. We started off at the chick. We come on 34 East to Union Center. At Union Center, there is fuel. You can get your gas there. Do start off with a full tank. Because you're going to be driving through here, and you're going to say, there is no gas stations out here. Keep on driving. We got some pictures to post on a Wednesday. Middle of the day, I took some shots. You're not going to believe how busy it was out there. So we were out there, we come up on 34, we dropped down on 73. Now we're heading south to Philip. There's fuel there, there's fuel in Philip. There was another little station here, I don't even think it had a name. Then we took 14, when we got to Philip, we took 14 back to Wall. We got to Wall, we visited there. We have some photos, we done some little videos in there. If you haven't visited Wall, it's a pretty neat place that takes you out into the Badlands. But this is a full day. You can go out here and you can stop at these spots. We got back to Wall, then we dropped back down to 90, and we made the return trip back to Sturgis. Now you can do it the opposite way. You can start off wherever you're at, Sturgis to Chip. You can do a reverse trip here. Go out to the Spur Creek Saloon, stop the full throttle. Your day is gonna be complete. Like I said, it's around 300 miles, that whole trip around there. Very interesting. So, stay tuned to the end of the video. I'd like to introduce you to Christy, new friend of mine, and I think everybody's going to enjoy it. Today we are at Waldorf. We started off Buffalo Chip. Went out to Shady Valley, where we'll probably stay next year, and we made a big loop around, and now we are at Waldrug. Okay, inside here you've got all kinds of little stores. Oops, excuse me. Go ahead.
This is one of their larger prairie dogs. <laughs> now this size prairie dog I could hit. And you get this big control in here, this size prairie dog. I know I can maybe get it. So I'm gonna find a bigger prairie dog than the one here. <laughs> I can introduce you to Christy. This is Christy. I named it Christy Eppner, the governor of South Dakota. When you see Christy, you know Christy means business. I'm sure we're going to be seeing more of Christy in the future. The governor of South Dakota and my Christy. So, let's for a heck of it, let's see how Christy works. Now I know what you're thinking. Did he shoot six shots or only five? Well, the truth is, it doesn't matter. 